The 2016 CIAA Men's and Women's Basketball Tip-Off Awards Luncheon was the kickoff for the CIAA Basketball Championship. The program started off with Dr. Kristen Kelly and a couple of distinguished guests, followed by a welcome by Trevor Fuller. Jada, what was the feeling like winning all CIAA Rookie Team and Rookie of the Year? Um, it's a great feeling. It's a great opportunity to have this, and um, I appreciate it a lot. Well, I mean, I work hard, so, I mean, it was something that was expected, but um, I'm glad to be here. It's, it's great. You know, I work hard. I continue to follow my dreams, chase my dreams. It's a great opportunity. It feels really good. It's a very good accomplishment. That was my goal coming in as a freshman. But to be honest, I didn't think I was going to make it, but I'm honored to be a part of the team. How hard did you work this year to get to where you at now? Uh, I work my butt off. Uh, my coach always gets he gets on me every practice. We get into we bump heads, but at the end of the day, I got to listen to him. I just got to work my butt off, and I guess I did, and this is what it got me. It feels good. It feels like I'm being rewarded for everything Coach Blow taught me, everything he tested me with. You know, it feels like I just improved. It's an honor. I mean, I work my uh, I work hard this year to uh, get on the team, and so it's a blessing. It's, it's a blessing, man. My teammates pushed me all year. I worked hard. It's a blessing to even have this achievement to be able to receive this. So. Player of the year. You know, most people can't say they're CIAA Player of the Year, so what makes this so special for you? Um, in the manner it, it happened, just with a successful season, with a great group of girls, and they made it happen for me. What's your theory? What's your method? Tell us about it. Um, my theory in behind blocking is timing. It's just with the right timing. And how do you feel being a defensive player of the year? Um, it's a great feeling. Humble and honored. I'm honored. I didn't think I was going to get this, but I'm honored and excited. Um, it's really an honor. Um, I'm very appreciative and very humble of this award. So. It's a great feeling. You know, I'm blessed and just... You know, happy to be here. It's an honor. I mean, I didn't think that I would be able to do it, but I did it. It was all in God's plans. I feel great about it. It's a blessing and an honor. Uh, I worked hard, so I'm happy that I'm here. It feels great, especially being my senior year, going out with this award, having time and time that, winning it, and finally pulling it off. All my hard work, all my hard work really paid off. Congratulations. It's definitely an honor. Um, I have to give it up to my team, because without them, I couldn't really do anything. So, And glory to God. It feels awesome. This is my first year here, so it's nice to be recognized as far as like me joining the program and recognizing my team and all. Um, it's just a tremendous feat. Just not, it's not just me. It's my teammates as well. They've helped me to get to this point and coaches as well. So it's for everybody on my team, I feel like. You are CIAA Player of the Year and you also own the all-time CIAA team. How are you able to keep your pace in the season and get to this point? I think that was all about putting work in in the off season in the summer. You know, I had a great season, you know, me and my dad working out, getting up 5 a.m. in the morning, you know. You know, you, you get out of it what you put into it, you know. So I put in a lot of hard work, you know, for this moment, you know, and it feels good. It's a special moment for you. Yes, ma'am, most definitely. Uh, just keeping my belief in God, you know, putting all my faith and all my uh, glory to Him. And also having a great support system around me, my mom, my brothers, all my kind of family, friends, teammates. You know, just all the love that they give me, is get motivates me to keep going. Uh, it feels great. It's my, always my dream to make first team. I got rookie of the year when I was a rookie four years ago, so it, it's good to get player, I mean, uh, first team. It's an honor to get this award and be recognized by the coaches and everyone that voted. So. Uh, just blessed, uh, you know, just a great opportunity uh, presented by Bowie State and the CIAA, and I just want to thank my coaches and, and my teammates for the opportunity. How are you guys able to work together to achieve this moment right now? Um, we just play off each other. Um, if one person doing good, we feed off him. So it really didn't matter. We both came to play every game. I feel like, man, we've been knowing each other for so long, we came in together, and now, that, now that we sing it, we're just trying to put it all together, and like you said, we feed off each other a lot. It feels wonderful just being able to be acknowledged and let my hard work pay off. Being able to stand out there with those guys means a lot. It feels great because um, coming to the season, I had a high role and the coaches, staff, and my teammates that stayed on me, they pushed me 
and it, it was my ultimate goal. Uh, I just want to thank God, my coaches, teammates, my mom. Uh, just my coaches believing in me every day over the summertime. That's where it really started in the summer, so they just kept me, kept me motivated. And then when we get to arrogant with the championship and the MVP, so I just humbled myself all year, trusted in God, and got me another, got me another trophy. <laughs> Coach, you won the Southern Division in the CIAA. How are you able to keep coaching your team to be successful and hopefully win the Seattle tournament this year? Oh, uh, getting quality players. You know, we had some good players coming this year and they've worked hard. You know, they know that the goal for this institution is to win the CIAA and I think the girls are focused to make that happen. Thank you. you know what? I, all the credit goes to the players behind me, the beautiful long, young ladies behind me. They did everything I asked them to do. They worked really hard on the court, in the classroom, and it just paid big dividends for them in the conference play. And how do you want to play out the CIAA championship for your team? You, we want to go out on top. I mean, we didn't come here just to uh, collect accolades. We want to really win this thing. We won the Northern Division. That's where it started. Our second championship is a tournament championship and then hopefully a national championship. Communication, you know, uh, hard work through practices, coach stand on us, and we just built a bond through the team in the locker room and came out on the court. Congratulations. Just hard work, um, hard work, dedication, and uh, trying to be consistent you know, in our effort every single day. I think that was the difference for us. For the Women's Coach of the Year, Virginia Union University and Marie Gilbert. The Men's Coach of the Year was Lonnie Blow Jr. from Virginia State University.